And welcome back. Well, school choice is a term that's used to describe programs that provide parents options about where their kids go to school. These options include traditional public schools, public charter schools, magnet schools, private schools, online academies, and even homeschooling. Joining us now to talk about it is Andrew Campanella, president of National School Choice Week. Good morning to you, Andrew. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Thanks for joining us. I think a lot of people uh, wonder what is the goal of National School Choice Week? What, is, what are we trying to accomplish by it? Sure, the goal of School Choice Week is to let parents know they have choices when it comes to their children's education. For example, families in Wisconsin can choose from traditional public schools, public charter schools, magnet schools, private schools, online academies, and homeschooling. Lots of different choices, and we want families to use School Choice Week as an opportunity to look into those. When you talk about the different types of schools that we have here in Wisconsin available to our children, how do you think we, um, I guess, how do, how do we add up educationally? Are, are we, do we have great opportunities here for education in our state compared to others? Absolutely. Wisconsin was a pioneer in developing some of the nation's first public and non-public school choice programs and policies, and then other states across the country followed suit. So Wisconsin families actually have more choices for their kids' education than families in many other states, which is why it's so important to make sure that your child is in an education environment that inspires, challenges, and motivates them to learn and to succeed. Well, and I think many parents probably just feel like, you know, what's close or what's convenient is really the only choice. So I think it's important that we educate ourselves. How can parents find out more about what options they have for education for their children? There are a variety of different resources available on our website, which is schoolchoiceweek.com, including a school choice guide for parents in Wisconsin. And that gives you all the information and links you might want to know in terms of the different types of choices we talked about. During School Choice Week in Wisconsin, there are hundreds of events in the Milwaukee area. There are also information sessions, open houses, rallies, you name it, with the goal of raising awareness among parents that they have these choices. What would you say to opponents? Because there's people on both sides of the topic of school choice um, who say, well, if we continue to do school choice, it takes money away from our traditional public schools. How do you address that question? I would say that when you look at school choice, we have to consider all the options available. And for the six options I mentioned, traditional public schools, public charter schools, magnet schools, online schools, those are all public options. So we're talking about a lot of choices within the public education system. I think that's gonna put a lot of people at ease and to learn more about it, I think really helps parents as well. Um, for you, I know that there's lots of events that take place during the school choice week. What types of things are going on in our community and around the country? Well, there are 32,240 events all across the country, hundreds in the Milwaukee area, school fairs, information sessions, school tours, parent nights, rallies, celebrations, an opportunity for parents to learn about the education options in their community so that they can visit schools and talk with teachers and administrators and begin the school search process if they do want to choose a different environment for their kids. And when you've talked to parents and you've worked on this issue, what do you hear families say about why they choose a different school than where they were attending? There are so many different reasons. Safety is a key concern. Parents want smaller class sizes in some cases. Parents want schools that focus on specific academic themes. Uh, parents want a specific instructional style for their students. Parents want schools where they feel as a parents that they're being empowered to be involved in their child's education. The key is what is right for your individual child is how to make the choice. I think that's great. I think we all uh, deserve safe, inclusive educational environments. So I know people can learn more by visiting schoolchoiceweek.com to find out about events, different opportunities, and educational um, options for School Choice Week. So thank you very much for joining us, Andrew. We appreciate it. Thank you. I appreciate it.